This is not what you're wearing tomorrow, right? Or no. like, okay. Or like, you mean Saturday? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's no, what no, I no. meant. I'm was not, it bad? I'm not was even, that it's reaction? Just, it's too casual. Like, you know. Yeah, this is too casual. Yeah, yeah. But I mean, we're casual now, right? <laughs> yes, we are. Hi, everyone. It's Lady Genevieve. I am Hi. here with Felix Sandman. Felix and Sandman. You've shot Great up in the here. odds recently. Did you know about that? You probably I don't did, know I did not. about that. No. It was weird. I know. I, I, like, I knew that, like, in the beginning, before, like, uh, the competition started, I was mm -hmm. really low. Yeah, and I was going, that's incorrect, because he's on 10, and, mm -hmm. like, and you were in Fo and O, and Fo and o did a lot of stuff, so I'm going, like, you can't rank that, him that, that low. But that can be good sometimes, because, like... Because people don't expect much. Yeah. yeah. But now you Maybe. shut up, yeah. Oh yeah, so now. I don't know if somebody leaked your song to uh -huh. the media or something, but now the hype is up, I think, for you. Okay. Yeah. But That's tell fun, us, that's yeah. fun as well, yeah. Tell us about you as Felix, the solo artist. Um, well, it, it has been like, uh, well, since we decided that we were going solo uh, and like doing our own stuff, mm. we've just been in the studio, mm. and I've been uh, going back and forth to LA two times uh, and just been writing songs and meeting and writing with dope people, really good people. And I've come up with some really good songs. Mm -hmm. And it's really like I'm in I'm in a good place of like right now in my life to 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 write songs and write mm -hmm. lyrics and music. So so that that feels really personal cuz that's what I've realized after like doing this for four years uh, with Fono that like what I want to do. I started off as like a musical artist, like dancing and all of that stuff. Um, and I I will always be a performer, but I've realized that like what my passion is really in music is to create music that has something behind it and mm -hmm. like uh, a meaning. To me, it doesn't have to be, like, a deep meaning or something, but just, like, something that's personal. Oh, that's very unprofessional. Mm. Uh, uh, something that has, like, a meaning for me and, like, something that's personal. And that's what's up with this song. It's that it's exactly that. Mm. And when um, we were going solo, uh, this song came up, and then um, I got the question to be... Uh, in my lift song, and I was like, this is a great opportunity to, because I was sure about this song, and I was like, I want to do this song. Um, it doesn't matter when uh, or, like, where. I just want to do it. Mm -hmm. And then Melody first of all then happened, so I was like, yeah, let's do it. It's, it's, I'm so proud of the song, so I just want to show it to, to Sweden and to all the world. Mm. So being that you were in the group and then the transition mm -hmm. in going solo, there's always rumors that there's drama. So would yeah, you like yeah. to dispel there's all of that no now? Drama. Yeah. There's no drama. There's no like zero drama. We just mm -hmm. had dinner yesterday and it's like we're brothers and we will. And that's like the good part about it. It's like it's just we've just grown each other like closer and closer over mm -hmm. the years. Uh, I mean, it was much harder in the beginning than he, now. Now it's like we're just so good friends and we just know each other. So mm -hmm. we're just like, we're like family. And I think that it's good for us to do this now because we're just like, we're in that place, like we're in that place in our life where we want to do that. Mm -hmm. And it feels good and we, we all need that. And then maybe we can get together. In the future. Reunion, yeah. yeah. Nobody knows. But, um, yeah, I think it'll be good. And we're really good friends. Because that was so the impression that's... that I got from you guys last year when mm -hmm. we sat down for our interview. I was like, you could tell that it was a real bond between the yeah. two of you. Yeah, we don't have to fake it. Yeah. <laughs> Just for PR. Like, <laughs> mm, we all get along great. Yes. Don't. No, yeah. Don't. Help me. <laughs> But can you tell us a bit? You don't have to spoil anything, uh -huh. but you've shot a music video, right? Because you're on 10, the uh -huh. most awesome label 10, in all Sweden. 10, the most awesome independent yes. label on this That uh, gets stuff planet. done. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, we've, we've shot a music video, uh, but there might be music videos. Oh, uh, we like that. Because there's like... I think the, there will be versions, like different versions. Oh, okay. um, but we have one. Um... 
Like a remix or? No, but just like. Acoustic? What maybe we- just like put out just a simple one for for the song to just like, that just works. And then maybe have another one that's more. Um, Flashy? Know, just, yeah, and just looks more money, I guess. <laughs> No, but like a more of a maybe a story or I don't know, like mm. something more, yeah, flashy. I would say. Yeah, go big or go home. Exactly. <laughs> but you can do like you can do great stuff with well, like low low budget and just like put something together. Yeah. And we do a lot of that stuff as well, and we've done a lot of that stuff. Um, but I don't know. I just feel like there would be more than one music video. Okay, well, that's something to look forward to then. Yes. So, is. with your Melody Festival in song, you said that it's something very personal to you. Yes. Did you have any reservations about being that it is something so personal, putting it in a contest specifically? Because I think the judgment is a lot harsher yeah. within the confines of a contest than if it's just a general release. Totally. Um, well, that has been like of course a thing and I just like I thought about it now today when I was rehearsing it um, cause I mean it means a lot to me and, and when it get like when when you get in routine and you just like do stuff and, and you don't think about the, like what the meaning of the song is and you just like think about cameras and all that mm-hmm. stuff I just stopped at one moment and just thought about what I was singing about mm-hmm. and then I got really emotional and just like I I don't like, I like to feel and I like to, um, I don't know, just let myself know that the, this means a lot to me and mm. I have to be aware of that mm. and, um, but then not lose focus, still, right. still get the cameras right and all mm-hmm. that stuff. But yeah, it's a hard thing with the competition, like overall, I mm. think, but it's, I guess it's even harder with, with, uh, a song that's like really me and really personal, I guess. Mm. Um, but I think that it will be, I think people will like it and mm. maybe it will be, yeah, a song that people vote, vote for because I believe in the song. So maybe the competition won't be so hard. Mm. Hopefully. Yeah. Uh, cause I believe in the song and it's a real song. It's a real, um, I don't know. The, the lyrics is really, it's really real. Mm. So then, as far as your staging and all that, we know you're not allowed to spoil anything. You don't have to mm-hmm. put yourself in trouble or I'm anything not dancing. like that. Yeah, but did you get to be involved in helping to design it? And who's on your team helping to put everything uh, together? Yeah, this is it's me and uh, Jenny uh, Vidigrin. Okay, she's called. Mm-hmm. Uh, she, did you remember Bounce, the dance group Bounce? I don't know. Nah, I don't were, even know. They were I huge right here now. in Sweden. Okay. <laughs> uh, <laughs> So it's like a dance group. She's great, uh, and like, and it's it's me and my my people from from ten as well. But we've like, we just came up with ideas, and and then we looped her in, mm. and she wanted to be, uh, she wanted to, to hop on. So we looped her in, and just like the 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 first thought was just like, this song deserves an intimate and and just like really live touch to it, cause. Mm. I don't. I don't feel like it would not do it good if it was like a big things happening and mm. just like things that that could take um, focus from the lyrics and the melody. Mm. So, so I think it really gets what it deserves. Mm. Um, so you, when you see the performance, hopefully you will like how it looks, but it will make you focus on what I'm singing and what I'm delivering and what I'm saying. Mm. You know you decide to make a big dog bark. You make me wanna wag my tail. So you did Melody Festival in last year of yes. course with Fo and O. So what was your overall impression of that experience? Um it was so much better than I expected and mm. so much funnier. Uh which was great. Funnier? Were you laughing a lot? What was funny? I mean no okay it was like <laughs> Fun? Yeah, it was fun. Yeah, it was oh. fun, and and it was it was more fun than I expected. Mm. Uh, and I don't know. It's just like so so much good people uh, working with the show, and I love to to meet new people and just like to get 
I don't know, to have jokes with people and just be like, it, when people are treating each other like a family, I I really get comfortable and I really like that. So, mm -hmm. so that was, I, th I feel like that was the biggest, like, the biggest part that I really liked about it. Mm -hmm. That it was really, like, um, yeah, it feels like a big family and... I guess it's a circus, um, as they always say. You guess. Yeah. Like it is. <laughs> it is for everyone, I guess, that's involved. Mm. Um, but I don't know. It's, it was it was just fun, and it's a cool cool stage to be on, mm. and you get to do a, a a big performance, and that's just like if you're a new artist, it's a great like I can imagine how to just be a new artist with your first single and ask me, I guess, but I'm. But I've I've done it before, but like go on a stage and just do a massive performance. That's something you dream of. So, so um, yeah, it's really really cool. Yeah, because you guys did a really good job with ten. It was your first mm -hmm. year in the contest, but you showed up with music videos. You had your follow up material. Mm -hmm. Follow up material had music videos. You released and, an album. Yeah, you released your album. You should have released Love Like This as a single. I'm very like. Uh huh. Oh, they don't make love like this no more. That classic touch I'm fighting for. No, they don't make love like this anymore. You know, I know. We've I feel been like friendly, you should. But, um... I feel like you should uh, try to work at ten. <laughs> 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 Don't tempt me, cause I'll like if you offer me a job, uh -huh. I will take it. Cause uh -huh. I'm yeah, not yeah. going back to America. No, absolutely well, not. Well, take the job. Mm -hmm. Take the job. I'm available. <laughs> just so you know, you can have me, like I'll scrub your floors. I don't care. I would rather nice. scrub floors and sweep in than. <laughs> yeah, cause that was a bop with the ones that you wrote with the. Was it the Debs or just the family? I was or, Debs. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, that was a bop. It was really good. Should have been a single. So you didn't do everything right. We did it, <laughs> but almost. I mean, yeah. no one's perfect. Yeah. But how is that environment for you working on a label that really has all of its stuff together? It seems um, like a great environment. Yeah. And your whole team. Uh huh. Hey, hey, how hey. You doing? <laughs> I feel like what I really love about it is this like how it all is like a family because it's really personal all the time and it's smaller and. For me, that like that's how I've always worked with like when I when I danced uh, at this musical school and and did all that stuff. It was really like um, what do you call it when it's like a family vibe? Uh, it was really, that's accurate. You can just say it like that. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. yeah. So and and when we when we started the foo and phono. Um, it was also such a family vibe mm. and just people working close together and and people that are ready to step out of their like a person might be a label manager mm. or um, I don't know but but they could do everything mm. basically or like not everything but they can at least try to help and yeah. they can at least be yeah just more and it's just a bunch of dedicated mixed with young and older people that are hungry and um, yeah can i ask you something really random yes you, m you might be weirded out by this but i saw because i follow you on uh, instagram <coughs> mm. and you posted something funny honor. a while back about like oh like i'm so dry like i need to moisturize or something like that and that yeah. was super funny uh -huh. but do you actually moisturize because i've noticed the patch right here uh -huh. and right here like i don't you know what you moisturize i just did before uh. we we came out. really I'm, I'm, I'm not like oh yeah. and that's the uh third time today <laughs> oh okay yeah and you already Maybe, what patch? yeah what product are you like i'm using this though like it's really good okay but because i've tried everything okay um have you tried like korean products Korean products? Yeah. No. You don't know about Korean skincare? No. You don't know skincare then. Oh, okay. Oh, no. I miss something. All right. Yeah. Can you can you bring me some? I have a watermelon face mask. I'll bring it tomorrow. I'll nice. like I'll put it on you and then nice. yeah. <laughs> nice. I can't have those masks though. Like they no 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 because like, they get dry right. No. Oh my god, you are. So I mean, when you put a face mask on, it just like no. It turns to stone. Depends on the mask. Okay. You are. So I've had sweetie, like you need so much. I've had help. like a chocolate thing in my face, and yeah. then it just. You need help. Yeah, I need help. Yeah, but I have a good products. I have good products, mm. but I just need a lot, I guess. Mm. And I need to do it in the right way, cause. Yeah. 
Therese always tells me to like, do it. Sweet, like, you're ashy. Like <laughs> no, but you like there's a there's a thing like a spray uh-huh. and a clean cleanser yeah. or whatever yeah. it's called. But I I just take the moisturizer and just fucking put uh-huh. it on. Uh-huh. Yeah. Yeah, you, you're but looking, I should you're do, do the cleanser yeah. and then the spray and then the moisturizer. I don't have time for that. Mm. But another thing we noticed about your social media is that you're really into a lot of like socio political stuff. Like we don't have to talk about politics, but just in a general mm-hmm. sense that yeah. it's something you're really passionate about. So is that like I think you have a feminism tattoo mm-hmm. and like so that's your whole what is it right there? Oh, there we go. Yeah. So tell us, that's, that's part of um, who you are. Yeah, it's, it's, it's a big part. And I, I just want to, like, that's, yeah, that's a big part of me. And I, I, wanted, I, I want to try to make, like, involve that into my career, I guess. And just mm. use, because I have people that are watching me and, and following me. And then if you have people watching and, and listening to you, then it then you should use your channels and stuff to just I don't know show good good things and and be a good role model I guess and just like talk about these things mm. that are so relevant. Um, and it's just like I want to do so much more, but but I'm like I've always thought about like I want to do everything I can, and when I reach huge success mm. that I want to reach, I can just make a even bigger impact. Mm. And, and like, so I want to do everything I can on the way, but um, I'm just looking forward, because that's a big, th- big thing I'm looking forward to, like becoming successful and maybe earn some money that you can give away to charity and just like do all that. But but in the meanwhile, just do everything you can and just like, because it's, it's on our... It's on a, what do you call it? Like, it happens everywhere. Like, mm. and, and the whole equality question and everything that's happening with Me Too and and everything. I, it's it's so good to see. And it's just we have to bring it down to that level. Like, it happens everywhere. Mm-hmm. So everyone can do something. It doesn't matter if you have two hundred k follower followers on Instagram. You can you can still talk about it and you can still still do stuff, mm-hmm. I guess. So then after Melody Festival and finishes, mm-hmm. presumably you've got some follow-up material ready, so tell us, or tease, I do. tease what's coming next. I got an album ready. A solo album? Yes. You have that much content already? Yes. When's it dropping? Uh, that's not decided yet. Mm-hmm. But um, there might be, like, this is the first single, and then maybe two more singles, or one, I don't know. Mm-hmm. We haven't decided, uh, really. But then I want to release an album, and I have content. Thank you for that saying that, because every sweet I talk to, the well, I don't know about albums. Nobody does albums anymore. I'm like, that's so weird. Cause... Darren just dropped his seventh number one album. Uh-huh. I don't know what you're talking but about. But people are making albums. I don't yeah. get it. Like, yeah, yeah. And that's I know. the cool part about being an artist yes. is to release an album. Yes. Thank you for understanding facts. God, I'm like getting into a fight every interview. I'm like, release an album. <laughs> release an release album. Release an album. Yeah. It's, I will. It's a whole battle. I will. That I have to fight. But you have to release singles as well. Yeah, of yeah. course. That's how you get your exposure. Mm-hmm. Make some paper and then exactly. release the album. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. Will you listen to my album? Yeah. Because I want to see what you're doing. Okay. Yeah. Nice. Good stuff. You have you heard my song, this song? No, we're going to hear it after this. Yeah. And I'll be all judgmental on Twitter. Like, mm, mm. this is what I think about it. <laughs> oh, so you all get to hear it after this? Yeah, the media. Oh, right. The media listens to the studio versions. Cool. So, yeah, I hope, Exciting. It's, hope it's good. But your song's not up-tempo, right? It's more like, yeah, so it might not be my favorite. Oh, because you're, you're a sucker I'm, for up I'm a hoe for up-tempo. Okay. Yeah. So you don't like emotional songs or like... If it's got a dance beat on it, then maybe, but... <laughs> You have a remix. Okay. See, I, I asked you about a remix. And you're like, no, 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 remix. N- not like a music video that uh-huh. is a remix, but we have remix okay. versions. Maybe I'll listen. I'll like slap that version on mm-hmm. it. Yeah. It's not, it's not like a dance beat, but it's like, it, it's drums. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, that's good. Uh, no, I, always, I love my up-tempo bangers. I love my flashy mm-hmm. visuals, all that good stuff. I'll get up-tempo bangers as well. Yeah. So. Well, presumably, I be mean, ready. you can't only release that type of music in yeah. your career. So, you know, mix it up. Yeah. So maybe it won't be I my will. favorite single of yours, but mm-hmm. 
but I'll always be honest. Nice. So <laughs> That's good. That's yeah, good. no, I don't like to lie. No. Some people wish I would, but I won't. I wish you'd... <laughs> I wish you not did not lie. Yeah. Well, that's good. So then we'll get along. So would you like to send a message to all the international fans? Um, they love you. And I love you. <laughs> um, I mean, thanks for watching, and thanks for staying supportive uh, while I'm here in Sweden. Because I want to come, like, I see a lot of tweets where, come like... Come to Brazil. Yeah, and I just want to go everywhere, of mm. course. Um, but it'll come. It'll come. It'll be a world tour, and we'll see each other soon. Take over the world. Yes. Uh, but in the meanwhile, I'll just... We'll just see each other on, on, on socials, and um, stay tuned for my music. And can you see my leaf song, like... Yeah, on, S of on SVT Play. You can when see it airs, everywhere. But then it gets geo-blocked, because <laughs> Swedish Whoa. logic. Yeah. Yeah. Watch my leaf song. I <laughs> uh, hope you like my single, Every Single Day. Uh, it means a lot to me. So, uh, take care, I guess. Is this a wrapping up? Yeah. 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 Take care. I love you guys. <laughs> Bye.